Hey, it's Dr. Todd Molsky of Freedom Health Centers, and we are talking about stress in the workplace. You know, when we come from uh, a point, I come from a point of uh, being a CEO of a company, uh, but also have been an employee of a company, and I have employees, uh, is I want to look at it from those kind of points of view uh, and making sure that uh, the CEO is understood and, and, and making sure that uh, they understand what's going on with the employee and, and vice versa. So stress in the workplace is a huge thing. Uh, you know, stress can come about via many different things, uh, especially in, uh, when you're dealing with the public. Uh, you know, uh, the customer is always right. Well, uh, I'd probably say no. <laughs> but uh, as a CEO, I really want to make sure that I'm backing my staff, that I have their backs. Uh, you know, if they do something wrong, of course, there's, uh, that's an issue there. But, uh, you know, making sure that we portray a confidence with them so that way they can do the job that they need to do. Um, in terms of other stress in the workplace, you know, really there's stress amongst employees. Uh, you do get those things that go on. You know, there are conflicts that happen there. We are human and things happen uh, and not everybody gets along, right? So uh, we want to make sure that uh, we uh, have the, the right methods to deal with all those things uh, in the office. Uh, one of the biggest things that uh, we always talk about uh, here is uh, problem versus solution. You know, if somebody, if one of my employees comes to me with a problem, that's not really good. I don't want to hear that. I want to hear, here is my problem and these are the solutions that I'm thinking of. What do you think? Very, very important to, to, uh, to get from an employee because uh, they are then thinking for themselves, which is good. They just want the confirmation from the from their supervisor. So, uh, very important thing. We we don't want to come with problems. Uh, if you're coming with a problem, you're you're just a problem yourself. Not very good. So, solution orientation is uh, is huge. Uh, some some other things is that one of the one of the biggest things also that I look at is that. You know, the, the shortest pencil is better than the longest memory. You gotta write things down. If you don't write things down, you're gonna forget. Uh, you're not gonna have all the right details that you need. Uh, using forms and things like that in your office for uh, those things are, are very important. These things, I talk about this because they cut down on the stress. That's the biggest thing. If you resolve things very quickly, you confront the issues and, and confrontation for a lot of people, that word is, is a negative, which I implore you to change that in your, in your mindset, to change confrontation as one of the healthiest things you can do. Because if you don't confront the thing that's going on, then it's going to linger. If it lingers and, and you haven't done anything about it, then you start to root over that. You start to you know, get in your mud puddle and kind of swish around and all that stuff. Not very good. It puts you in a, in a mindset of you know, us versus them or something like that. And the conflict gets worse and worse. And you ever notice that you really start to make things up? In your own mind, it's pretty amazing how we all do that. I do it too. It's it's not good, uh, but I just learned that writing those things down, confronting it as quickly as possible, having a solution to the problem is vital. So, uh, from a CEO point of view, from an employee point of view, doing those things, uh, having each other's backs, working together as a team, man, you can really go out there and, and help a lot of people and. It doesn't matter what uh, you know, type of business you're in, what type of job you have, you know, you're there to help, and, and that is our jobs uh, to improve the company, uh, because the company you're you're along the lines of the the company's purpose. Now, if if the purpose, like with our, you know, our purpose is to save lives by adjusting the way people eat, move, and think, that is our purpose. Everybody knows that here. You know, if, if the, the, the 
purpose of the office is this and your purpose is this and you guys are going just like this awesome if your purpose is going like this and that's not gonna work you know you gotta align with the purpose uh, very very important thing to do uh, all those things cut down on stress within the workplace uh, from an employee point of view and from a CEO point of view. So, you know, work on those things. Write it down. Make sure you're confronting. Make sure you, you've got your good purpose uh, stated and everybody knows it. So, uh, Dr. Todd Molsky, Freedom Health Centers.